Hello, it's the 26th of August 2014 and this is just a little video diary to show you where the site is at the moment. My name's Ed, I'm the current chair and uh, we'll take you through and just show you some of the developments that's happened. So looking across to the main gates, they're all painted, the red circles are in the centre. You can see that gives it a, a railway kind of feel. So as you move through the gates, you can see that the flower bed has been finished, planted up, and looks quite a good. We'll just go over to the plant bed and show you a better view of what has happened here. We've got Fimberholt spelled out in uh, white stone. I'm looking across. Okay, we're now I'm going to look down the site to see what developments have happened. That's a more road planings that's been delivered which will be used at the bottom of the site and also on the path that leads up to the picnic site. And as we move off down the site you can see the buffers <coughs> have been um, made and put in place with also all the fencing down the site. I'll give you a close-up of the plaque that was unveiled at the uh, members afternoon. So now all the fencing is finished round the demonstration line. We have a gate to stop the public getting onto the actual track. And it definitely has given the site that kind of feel. There's our engine, Eddie. We just take a peek over the fence. You can see that the track has now been totally ballasted, the shoulders sorted out, and is ready for some running. I'm going to take another view looking back up. And back down the line again. And there we can see the coach with its uh, platform. And some more flowers just to give it a, a nicer look. We've also got some gates which separate the, uh, the public area from the volunteers staff area and we also have the blue toilets you know for use of the public when on site and stuff like that this will be exchanged for a disabled toilet in due course so if we move on down we can see the platform coming into sight now finished there is a bit of bracing to do underneath but not a lot but it is mainly finished and here we have the area where you would alight onto the loco when we're all done and take you up and this is the platform which allows access to the coach for the public Take a quick look through the window. The bench has been made. 
and we're all painted inside the coach just waiting for its final coat with the floor finished and all the rest of it and we're now on to doing the grey undercoat before the final coat of paint that has been selected. So I hope you've enjoyed watching, I hope you keep watching and see the further developments down at Fimberholt, the Yorkshire Worlds Railway. Thank you very much, my name is Ed, goodbye.